members of the Association for Formidable Education and Development, led by the national president, Mr. Ojikano Emmanuel, and the state controller, Osage Runse, said they were in her office to formally congratulate her on the recent appointment and expressed the belief that the sector will witness more development. The group also appeals to the Commissioner for Education to carry the association along in the new scheme of things. I want to congratulate you for the position. My controller told me that you are deserving of it. I really want to say, ma, thank you for what you have done for the rest. Let me quickly bring it to you to bring it also to local schools in the states. We are not against the government policy. Rather, we try to see how these upcoming schools can do the right thing. Dr. Juan Osa of Yahweh said Edo State Government is committed to educational reforms and it is keen to work with stakeholders in both public and private as a way of developing the sector. So for us, we are certainly very keen to engage with all stakeholders, particularly those that mean well for the children and learners of Edo State. And so we are preparing to go out there and then meet with different stakeholders group to talk about the education reform vision of His Excellency. You have heard of Edo Best 2.0. Yeah. Yeah. There are five pillars. Uh, those five pillars are not for decoration. Yeah. The group also visited a Benin-based legal practitioner and notary public of Nigeria. Barisa Olaiwo La Folabi were the solicited for legal assistance as legal advisor to the association. When you see this type of people affected, you see that they are committed, they are, they are people who know where they are going. So I have no choice than to accept to be the legal advisor. So I'm very I'm, I'm proud to be associated with them and we will take that course. In a press briefing at the state secretariat of the association, Forestry Road, Benin City, the state controller affected. Osai Gerunse said the association has made progress in the past four years with over 200 local schools approved by the state government while over 400 orders are now task compliant. The then again, we also want to appeal to the government of the day to look at the plight of multiple taxation and levies. In an interview, the president of AFED, Oji Kano Emmanuel, and the vice president of the association said representatives of the association from the 36 states are in Benin to brainstorm on ways to move the association forward. Concerned with the growing number of out of school children. And um, that meeting is um, geared towards addressing that problem. It's about the way forward in AFED Nigeria. And the meeting is for all the states, all the controllers and their ESCO in all over Nigeria, the 36 states, including the BOT. Association for Formidable Education and Development, AFED, we started in Nigeria 21 years ago, stands for affordable and quality education for millions of out-of-school children in the country. De